Alright, hey guys, I just wanted to make a really quick video about how to um, set up the linting in Expo in it to be the same as it is for the React Native command line in it um, because for some reason the Expo linting just doesn't, or the Expo in it doesn't really come with any uh, linting like pre setup already and it took me a little bit to figure out how to get it exactly the same as the React Native one. So we just went ahead and uh, edited a new project with the blank template and we're just going to firstly add two packages um, eslint zero and um, at react native community slash uh, eslint dash config point zero point zero. So we're going to go ahead and add those and then the only thing we need to do Let's create a new file called .esnrc.js, and uh, in this we just need to put the following code so that it extends React Native Community. And now we should see, so this isn't throwing an error, it takes a second to uh, update if we reload our window. Uh, this isn't throwing an error, but then once the, uh, it takes a minute to update and that's what really threw me for a loop. is. If you I was like, why is this not working? But there it is. And now we can see we're getting our linter errors just the way we want them. Um, and actually, I think in the newer version of uh, React Native uh, community, a lint for, e for ESLint, it, this, this won't throw an error, uh, it not being defined, which I don't like. So I want to use that 2.0.0, which is used in uh, React Native uh, in it right now. So yeah, that's it, guys pretty simple. Uh, thanks for watching.